Today we are going to see the backup based duplication in Oracle DDBase 12C release 1. So let's see how do we do that. In my case, I already done my production DDBase backup using the Ormen, which is uh, already moved in my NFS directory. So if you find this, see my mouse pointer is the primary backup. My backup is already exist there. The major requirement for this activity is the backup from the overman. So I already done that. So my backup is already available in the slash backup directory or I already showed there. So now what we have to do means <clears throat> preparing the um, what the target node that means the axillary node the standby I need to prepare it the user creation and the directories everything we need to create by the oracle user is already accessed i already done that the software installation is already done now i need to create the directories along so i am creating the directories the edump the very everything i need to create so i'm using this commands that means the making the directory here So the one directory is there. There is a flash recovery directory. <clears throat> yeah, so the creator. So the next is the PFA. So which will be required for the no mount state. See my uh, DB name parameter is USA and I'm doing the cloning with the same name because I'm doing for the purpose of standby so it will be on the same name if you want to change it means you can able to change it it's possible to change see static no mount I am providing the command static no mount so I have to pass the startup on that state because I'm going for another mode here. So yeah, my database is now in no mount state. So I need to exit from this prompt. That means the SQL prompt. And connect it to the auxiliary slash. Let's and provide the command duplicate database to clone db name that means that clone db name is usa in my case if you want to change it you can able to change it it doesn't matter but you have to use the db name db file name converter log file name convert parameters and the file systems everything you have to change it up backup location is my NFS mount directory and no file name check it will be required if you are using the db file name convert parameters in my case it's not required but I'm providing this because it's my day to day activity yeah it will be going fine my database backup will be started here and the restoration will be started there yeah, it's complete. See, this is it, friends. It's a way of cloning. That means the backup based cloning in the very fast method and will be the safe method in the production environment. Thanks for watching, guys. Hope it will be helpful for you all. See, my USA directory is, my database is up. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.